Tech, Mary speaking. How may I help you? Yes, is Bob Smith in? May I tell him who's calling? Yes, this is Mark Barry. Good morning, AIE. Good morning. I'd like to talk to Mr. Robinson. Is he available? I'll check for you. May I ask your name? My name is Susan White from Pac Bell. Hyatt Incorporated, how may I help you? Yes, my name is Larry Tate from California Internet. May I speak to Mrs. Christensen? Sure, just a minute. I'll transfer you. Hello, Penn College Admissions Department. How may I help you? Hello, um, I'm calling for uh, Jody Warrens. Oh, right. You mean Judy Warrens? Yes, I think that's right. Hold on one second. I'll put you through to her line. Would you like to meet at 6? I'm sorry? I, I couldn't hear that. Would you like to meet at 6? I'm sorry. Could you please repeat that? What time is good? Oh, 6 would be fine. Hello. May I speak to Ron, please? Hello? Hello? Yes. May, may, may I speak to Ron, please? H Hello? I'm sorry, I can't hear you. It's a bad connection. I'll call you back. New York Legal Associates, how may I help you? Yes, I would like to speak to someone in accounting, please. I'm sorry, sir. I, I can't hear you. Yes, I, I would like to speak to someone in accounting, please. Sir, I'm sorry. I can't hear you at all. Please call us back. Westernware, may I help you? Oh, isn't this Office Max? No, I'm sorry. You must have the wrong number. Sorry about that. No problem. Hello? Hi, may I speak with Robbie Robertson? Mm, I think you have the wrong number. Oh, sorry to bother you. That's all right. Hello, doctor's office. Can I help you? Hello, I'm calling for Jane Heller. Who? Uh, Jane Heller. I'm sorry, there's no one named Jane Heller that works here. Is this 7980983? No, this is 7980986. Oh, sorry about that. It's okay. American Chamber of Commerce, how may I help you? Yes, I was calling for the secretary to the executive director. Hold the line, please. Sure. Geo Markets, this is Ben speaking. May I help you? Yes, I'd like to speak to Don Anderson, please. I'm sorry, he's with a client right now. Would you mind holding? No, I don't mind. Thanks. Hello? Yes, is this Language Systems? Yes, it is. May I help you? Yes, I'd like to speak with the manager. She's with a customer right now. Could you call back later? Actually, may I hold for her? Sure, no problem. a and Insurance, may I help you? Yes, my name is Kevin Richards from Great Western Bank. May I speak to someone in accounting, please? Sure. Just a moment, please. Yes, I'm calling for Miss Smith. I'm sorry. She's at lunch. May I speak with Mr. Hegg? I'm sorry. 
He's not in the office today. He'll be back tomorrow. May I speak with John Franco? I'm sorry. He's not in right now. Hello. This is Goldfield Media. How can I help you? Hello. I'm calling for someone in your Human Resources Department. Sure. Just a minute. I'll transfer you. Thank you. Goldfield Media Services, how may I help you? Yes. May I have extension 344, please? Just one moment. Mason and Mason, how may I direct your call? Hi, I'm calling for the Executive Director. May I ask who's calling? Sure. This is Jennifer at Simpson Consulting. I'm calling about the new promotion. Okay, the Executive Director's name is Mr. Johnson. He's at extension 50. Just a moment, I'll transfer you. Okay, thank you very much. Hello, Landforms. How may I help you? Hello. May I have the number for the accounting department, please? Yes, it's 112. Would you like for me to transfer you now? Yes, please. Hello, G&H. May I help you? Yes, I'd like to speak to Ray Johnson, please. I'm sorry, he's not in right now. Would you like to leave a message? Yes. Could you please have him call Harry Donald at 555-4564? Sure, no problem. Thank you. Northern Electric, this is Jack. How may I direct your call? Hi, may I speak with Janice Jones? Janice is at lunch. She'll be back in about an hour. Could I leave her a message? Sure. Please tell her that Sue Grant called. Could you have her call me back at home? Does she have your number? Yes. Okay, I'll let her know. Thank you. No problem. Dr. Jackson's office. Yes, this is Tony Reynolds. May I speak with Dr. Jackson, please? I'm sorry, Mr. Reynolds. Uh, he's with a patient right now. May I leave a message for him? Sure. Please tell him that my wife's fever has gone and that she feels much better now. Okay. Anything else? Yes. Could you please have him call me at home when he gets the chance? Sure. What's your number? It's 234-9934. Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Sure. Bye-bye. Hello. Thank you for calling Bell Electric. If you know the extension number you are trying to reach, enter it now. For general information, press 1. For office hours, press 2. For accounting, press 3. For human resources, press 4. For advertising and marketing, press 5. To speak to an operator, press 0 or hold on the line. You have reached the accounting department at Bell Electric. We are unable to take your call at this time. Please leave us a brief message after the tone or call back later. Thank you. Hello. This message is for Jim North. This is Gray Matthews calling from TC and Company. Please call me on my mobile at 456-5055 or at home at 332-3844. Thank you very much. Northern Financial, how may I help you? Yes, hello. My name is Kevin Ryan. I'm calling from United Supply. Yes? I'm calling regarding the letter I sent about the meeting with Mr. Jones. 
A letter? When was it sent? It was dated the 20th of April and sent the same day. I'm sorry, we haven't received it. Could you fax it or email it to us? Sure. I'll fax it. Could I have your fax number, please? Yes. It's 7890987. Attention to whom? Uh, you can attention it to Mr. Beale. Okay. Thank you very much. I'll send it right away. Hello, BIT. May I help you? Hi. My name is Paul Jackson. I'm calling from Smith and Easton about the email that we sent to you on the 5th of January. Just a moment. Let me check here from the record. It looks like we didn't receive it. Really? I sent it on the 5th. No, there's nothing here. Could you send it again? Sure. Uh, what's your email address? Maybe I had the wrong one. It's info at bit.com. It's not bit at infonet. No, that's the old address. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'll send it again. All right. Robinsons, may I help you? Yes. What are your hours today? We're open from 9 to 8 today. Thank you. No problem. This is La Luna Restaurant. How can I help you? Um, hi, yes. What are your weekend hours? Uh, we're open from 7 a.m. to 11 p.m. Friday through Sunday. And how about on weekdays? On the weekdays, we're open from 7 to 9. Okay, thank you very much. No problem. Western County Courthouse. How may I direct your call? Yes. Would you be able to give me directions to the courthouse? Sure. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from Main Street in Jacksonville. Okay. Take Highway 24 to 9th Avenue and turn left. The courthouse will be on your right-hand side. Okay. Thank you very much. Dr. Jones's office, can I help you? Yes. Hi. I have an appointment this afternoon and I need to know how to get there. Okay. Where are you coming from? I'm coming from downtown. All right. Go north on Valley Avenue until you get to Central Street. Okay. North on Valley to Central. Then turn right on Central and go straight for five kilometers. Okay. Right on Central, straight for five kilometers. You'll see our building on the left-hand side. Left-hand side. Is there parking? Yes, there is. You can park your car in the front of the building or in the back parking lot. Okay, thank you very much. Of course, don't mention it. Webnet, may I help you? Yes, I'd like to confirm my appointment with Mr. James for tomorrow at 10 a.m. Okay. Just a minute. I'll check his appointment schedule. Are you Mrs. Jensen? Yes, that's me. Okay, well you're scheduled for 10 a.m. tomorrow. Okay, thank you very much. Sure. Worldwide Travel, how can I help you? Uh, yes, I'd like to confirm my flight to New York on Monday. Okay, can I have your full name, please? Uh, yes, it's John Landry. It's L-A-N-D-R-Y. Okay, your flight is confirmed for Monday at 9 a.m. on United Flight 53 from Houston, nonstop to New York. Can I help you with anything else? Uh, no, thank you. That'll be all. You're welcome. Thank you for calling Worldwide Travel. Okay, goodbye. 
Hello, Bell Systems. This is John speaking. How can I help you? Hi. My name's Donna Anderson, and I would like to confirm my interview with Mr. Grant tomorrow. Okay, Ms. Anderson. Uh, please hold for just a minute, and I'll check his schedule for you. Sure. Ms. Anderson? Yes. It looks like you've been scheduled for the day after tomorrow. Really? Well, I guess that would be okay. Is it for 9 a.m. also? Um, let's see here. Yes, 9 a.m. So we'll see you the day after tomorrow then? Yes, that's fine. Thank you very much. Uh, my pleasure. Hello, this is InfoWeb. May I help you? Yes, my name is Frank Robbins from Computer World. I would like to schedule an appointment with Mr. Walters concerning the advertisement in the Tech Journal. Okay, just a moment, please. What day would you like to meet Mr. Walters? How about this Thursday? Okay, let's see here. He's available at 2 o'clock on Thursday afternoon. Is this okay? Yes, that's fine. Okay, Mr. Robbins, I'll schedule you for 2 o'clock this Thursday afternoon. That sounds great. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thanks for calling Liberty Mills. This is Joe speaking. Hi, this is Donna Winters calling from Intel Consulting. I'd like to organize a meeting with Mrs. Kim. May I ask what this is regarding? Yes, she called me about a real estate plan yesterday, and she'd like to meet with me next week. Yes, Miss Winters, right? Yes. How about next Monday? That would be fine. Okay, is 10 in the morning all right? Yes, that would be good. Okay, so that's next Monday, 10 o'clock in the morning. I'll let Miss Kim know. Thank you very much. No problem. Mr. Olson's office, may I help you? Yes, this is John Franklin from Boston Publishing. Good morning, Mr. Franklin. What can I help you with? I need to cancel my appointment with Mr. Olson for tomorrow. I won't be able to make it. Okay, would you like to reschedule? Yes. How about next week? Let me check his schedule for you. Hmm. Okay, how about Thursday at 3 o'clock? Yes, that would be fine. Okay, we'll see you then. Thank you very much. Art department, may I help you? Yes, I'm calling for Professor Lauren. I'm sorry, she's with a student now. Can I take a message? Yes, I'd like to postpone my meeting with her. Uh, when was your meeting scheduled? For today at 4 o'clock. Okay, and when would you like to schedule the other meeting? I'd like to meet with her on Tuesday in the afternoon. Okay, let's see. How about 2.30? Sounds great. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Good evening, Bella Restaurant. May I help you? Yes, good evening. I'd like to make a reservation for two at nine o'clock. Sure, could I have your name? Yes, it's Smith. Okay, that's a reservation for two at nine o'clock for Smith. Is that right? Yes, that's right. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you for calling London Travel. This is Ron. May I help you? Yes. I'd like to make a reservation for a flight to Tokyo. Sure. What day would you like to travel? Monday the 7th of September. For how many people? Two people. What class? First class, business, or coach? Uh, coach, please. Coach. Okay, I have a flight departing at 10 a.m. on Japan Airlines. 
how much is a one-way ticket? Seven hundred dollars. Okay. Uh, can you book this for my wife and I? Sure. What are your names? My name is Mr. John Gray, and my wife's name is Mrs. Linda Gray. Okay. I've got you and your wife booked for the Japan Airlines Flight 60, departing London the 7th of September at 10 a.m. Okay, thank you very much. No problem. Thank you for your call. This is Cindy. How may I help you? Yes, I'm calling about the ad in the LA Times. Regarding the teaching job? Yes. Uh, could you come in for an interview? Oh, that would be great. How about tomorrow, three in the afternoon? Uh, okay, that, that, would, that would be fine. And what's your name? My name is John York. Okay, John. We'll see you at 3 p.m. tomorrow afternoon. Do you know how to get here? I think so. Uh, you're located on Main Street, right? Yes, across from the McDonald's. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow then. Okay, goodbye. Bye-bye. Home Emporium, may I help you? Yes, I'm calling about your ad in Home Magazine. Uh, which ad? The one with the $200 refrigerator. Oh, yes. It's the GE50 model, right? Yes, that's correct. Do you have any left? Yes, we do. Could you hold one for me? I'm coming right now. Sure. What's your name? My name is Terry Mills. Okay. I can hold one for you until 5 o'clock. Okay, great. Thank you very much. No problem.